Hi, welcome to this YouTube channel. My name is Ndivo Maginya. Um, you know, lately YouTube has been flooded by a lot of chat GPT videos. Everyone is making a chat GPT videos. But um, there's something interesting that, um, you know, I saw people, you know, trying to do it, but they didn't explain it thoroughly and to a way that um, a person who doesn't know how to code or who doesn't know any programming language can literally follow and, and, and set up chat GPT with WhatsApp. So in this video tutorial, we are going to be learning how to connect uh, chat GPT to WhatsApp so that you can text it on WhatsApp and it will give you all those nice responses and, 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 and you can be able to chat to it anywhere you are. What we're going to do first is to download the package for WhatsApp GTP, um, GPT um, that was uh done by daniel gross um thank you daniel for uh sharing with us this package uh, so that we can be able to connect our um, our whatsapp with uh chat gpt so when you get here to this um uh, uh, website or git uh github you're going to download this zip folder um i have downloaded it before so yeah, after downloading it, um, going to save it wherever you want to save it, then show in Finder, then you will be able to extract that, um, and then after extracting that, it will show you uh, something like this. So, um, this uh, WhatsApp Git, um, you have to run uh, this uh, server.py and this server i mean this main.go so that you can you are able to um to 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 successfully uh connect this whatsapp and 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 and, and chat gpt so the first step now will be to open um our terminal so under terminal there are a lot of um, things that you will have to install be before you continue here because um, what we would normally do would be to direct to, I mean, to, to go to the directory where that WhatsApp is. Um, and then after that, you will then, uh, uh, um, you know, just run that server.py or you run um, main.go. Um, so... What we're going to do now is that um, we are going to um, simply, uh, you know, navigate to to our um, our WhatsApp. So I know it's, to me it's in in, in downloads. So I'll, uh, you know, navigate to downloads, um, and then when I'm in downloads, I'll then navigate to the WhatsApp folder. So already I have that CD WhatsApp GTP dot main because I've extracted it. And um, when I'm here, um, when I was trying it out, there were some packages that were missing uh, that I had to install. First of all, it was Python. And for you to install Python, you need Homebrew. Um, so Homebrew, uh, what we're going to do now is to navigate to uh, Homebrew through install we just search on, on in, in a normal google search and um i'm not a robot uh, what are the traffic lights oh, where are the traffic lights so um next and then tractors uh, um, ah, really do they really have to do this okay yeah then so we go to homebrew um click here remember this is made for linux or or uh, mac or os so you when you open the the home uh, uh, brew or brew.sh you will find this link you just copy it as it is and then you go back to your terminal folder then you paste that here then it will ask for password um, then you will do your password and if you want to continue to install you install right and then it will do all the necessary stuff uh, that it has to do then it finishes the installation now it's done installing um, 
uh, homebrew. So now the next thing that we have to install will be um, the the Python because there was no Python installed onto my computer. Uh, that's why mine was failing. And um, that was the first problem. So there, there were many problems that had to come. So, so now that you have installed um, your homebrew, um, you will then need to install Python because um, if you don't have Python in your computer, the, what is going to happen is that when you try to run server.python or .py, um, it will not run because you don't have uh, 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 Python on your laptop or on your Mac. So what you're going to do now is to install um, uh, Python. So you say brew install Python, then you run it, then it will you know, tell you the warning that you already have Python 3 or me because I have already installed it in my uh, laptop. So you will have to install that on yours as well. So after installing Python, the next plugin or package that we are going to install, it's called uh, Flask. So we are going to install Flask because when you are running the server.py, it will not allow you to run. It will ask you uh, about this package that is missing because it has to import um, uh, this package from, from Flask. So what we are going to do, we are going, going to say Python uh, dash M pip install Flask. Right, then we install Flask, then it installs uh, already Flasks, um, I mean, rather Flask exist in my um, in my laptop because I, I had installed it. And then, um, so it, it won't, it, if you show that it's installing, it will just give you the message that already this is satisfied. So after installing Flask, um, you will then need to install what we call Playwright. Uh, Playwright. Because also when you are trying to run after installing Flask, uh, it will give you an error that Playwright doesn't exist in your package, and it want, the, the, the server.py want to import that into its its its, its uh, build. So we'll then uh, do npx Playwright install. Uh, then we install uh, that Playwright. So there you go. We have Playwright. Um, then. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to install node here. Um, so brew uh, install node. Um, so I'm making sure that all the packages are available so that when we build or when we try to run the server, it doesn't give us a problem. So let's, let's, let's do it. So brew install. Then as you can see, it says that node already is already installed and it's up to date on my uh, computer. The most important thing is to first install a homebrew um, so that you can be able to install Python. After installing Python, you can have all these packages that you can install, right? So now I've opened two terminal windows where I am going to run um, two scripts. Uh, the other one will be server.py and the other one will be main.go. All these scripts exist within the folder, the WhatsApp GPT folder that we had downloaded uh, from Daniel. Um, so uh, what I'm going to do now is to CD to downloads. Um, uh, so CD to downloads, then I will then uh, navigate again to WhatsApp GPT uh, slash um, main or oh, WhatsApp GPT main. Um, then on this one, I'm going to run what we call um, a command called main.go so i will tell it to go um run uh, main dot go so why am, am i running this this one um i'm running this one so that you can it can generate a qr code for us to be able to scan um just like what we do with whatsapp web uh, where you scan your whatsapp so i'm going to be able to scan that whatsapp um and then it will uh, uh, link that uh, WhatsApp web together with um, with the um, uh, uh, the chat, chat GPT. So let's run it. Um, it's running. Let's see. Then that is the QR code. Um, so with the QR code, so I'm going to open my WhatsApp here. So let me also do screen recording here on my phone so that 
you can see what's going on there we go so i'm going to open my whatsapp then go to link device on the link device then i scan that qr code so you can see it's logging in um there we go um on the phone you see it has logged in and then um it is connected so while it's doing its stuff on this other side now let's go on the other side and try and um uh, 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 open you know server.min so we're gonna say um python uh, server uh, dot pi so we're gonna run uh py, python uh, server.py here um so it will automatically open this as you can see it has opened chat gpt and um i've seen uh, yesterday i was experiencing a lot of problem while trying to open chat uh, gpt on chromium so um it was giving me issues to try and you know prove that i'm not a robot i tried to click that i'm a human being i'm a human being i'm a human being it never worked it never worked so i went on and did some amendments on the script uh, on the server script right um so uh, 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 on the server script i went on and did some 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 amendments so i'm going to show you how i did that so what i'm going to do now you can see now it's opening on on firefox and not using um it's not using a, actually a chromium so what i went on and did uh, let me close this let me close this um let me uh, press Control C to halt to stop the the server from running. But this one I'm not going to stop it. I'm just going to leave it like this. Uh, the main dot go. So let's navigate to this and open uh, server dot pi. So it will open um, here. So you can see online number um, uh, online number uh, uh, sixteen. It says play uh you know and then it asks to play with chromium uh lunch present uh, persistence dot context right so here is where the trick the trick lies right so here this is where you change um instead of uh instead of opening with chromium then change it to firefox so that it doesn't give you the issues of it trying to prove that you're a human being you're not a robot so Firefox uh, does it uh, quite nicely there. So I said it must launch using um, uh, 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 Firefox rather than uh, Chromium. So that's that's the only amendment that I've done on this one. So after that, you will you know press Command Save uh, to save this script, and then after that, uh, you will then um, go back to. Um, to 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 your servers, right? Um, so let's uh, just hide this one, and then close that one. So now, uh, after making those amendments, that's when you are going to come and run. Um, let me just clear first. You're going to come and run that command uh, Python server.py, right? Then you run it. It will open this um on firefox rather so here we have it um as you can see on my uh whatsapp it says that it's connected it's, it, it named it other device so we go back um you can see uh that's that's uh my whatsapp there so i'm going to again open um my whatsapp on on my other phone right um so that i can text uh, 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 this one and see if something that um, will reply will be a, a chat, chat bot or chat GPT so um, let's let's try it and see if it works so I'm going to go ahead and name that 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 um, uh, the numbers from that phone uh, and name them chat GPT right the numbers that i'm using on that other phone the whatsapp numbers that i'm using on that other phone you get to chat gpt so here i am on um 
that uh, that phone number you can see it says it's online because uh it's online here as well you see there's no chats i don't use this whatsapp so yeah um i, I just created it for the sake of you know this um so i'm going to send a text message and see um what's going to happen hi right um you can see on on the screen of our computer it says uh how hi how can i help you today and um uh it's chat gpt right it's, it's the one that is answering uh let's say please um write me a a song a love song right a love song by the way i was i was um a rapper back then back in the days you know yeah you can see it's writing on the um uh, computer screen it's not yet sent to me uh but it will send it once it's done right um once it's done it will send um so you will see it doesn't show that it's typing uh on the other side um right and on my other phone you can see that uh the message has come through and then nothing i'm doing nothing there it's typing then it sends you see so it writes verse one this is what you can do in your eyes i see forever my heart skips a bit whenever whatever we're together you see so this is this is nice there, there are a lot of possibilities with this one um with linking whatsapp uh with chat gpt uh some of them will be to to actually make chat gpt be the friend of your uh, child where it will assist with homework because they can just text instead of going to the internet and you know browsing the net and whatever and whatever they can just text it on whatsapp and it will answer all their questions and um what's nice about it also is that multiple people can chat to me and it will be answering all those people uh, uh with that um uh, 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 uh chat gpt so this is this is like future um the only thing that i'm trying to crack uh of which i see is the downside it's um when someone has asked a question and then um another one comes and asks a follow-up question because it's using one 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 chat here on 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 chat gpt you will then receive a response for someone else because if if you ask it to expand on on a question that was asked by someone uh, by, by someone it will expand on that conversation that is continuous so uh, that is the only downside uh, i wanted to create like some sort of like chat uh, for for each and every one who creates a new chat uh, on 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 whatsapp with it so so that it can follow up on your conversation and link your conversation nicely this is how you link um chat gpt with your uh whatsapp i hope you enjoyed this um thank you very much for watching uh, my youtube channel uh, i hope this was helpful and um, subscribe for more and uh, request videos um, i fell in love with chat gpt so i'm going to do a lot of you know research about it and i'll be making a lot of videos so if you want to ask to link um you know your chat gpt with telegram drop in the comments below so that i can show you how to do that thank you so much